Hey everybody, I'm here at the Equip Expo at the Toro booth with Matt, and Matt's going to walk us through their Commercial Pro series of outdoor power equipment. Matt, what do we got going on here? You got a bunch of stuff. It's all yeah. new. Is it all new? Uh, so it's all, it's not all new. Uh, so the Revolution handheld series has been around for a little while now, a couple years. Um, primarily we're going to focus on three tools here. So we're going to have our commercial grade hedge trimmer. This is going to have uh, some wider tooth spacing as well as an extended bar uh, for those longer applications, those more commercial applications, if you will. It's pretty um, light too. Pretty light, yep. Uh, and then kind of coming over then too as well, we're going to have more of our string trimmers here. So our string trimmers are going to have a solid steel shaft. This thing is designed to get bumped around on a trailer or on a truck. We made this thing as durable as we could. Uh, is there a, um, a cable in here? Is it or down here? Is the motor up here? Which uh, so the motor is going to be in the back here. Uh, so there's going to be a cable that runs down. Runs a cable to that. Yep. Okay, I got you. Yep. Um, and then with that then too, the main difference between our commercial lineup string trimmer versus our residential line string trimmer is going to be the motor that we have in here. So in here we're going to have a 1.2 kilowatt motor, brushless motor, uh, just to give that improved performance as well. Nice. Stemming off of that then too, I'm going to come over to our backpack blower. And i got to be honest with you, our backpack system is my favorite. Oh uh, yeah, so I see why. With our backpack blower here, we're going to get an impressive 730 CFM on the backpack blower here with the Canon. But what's really cool is actually going to be, you can use this backpack as a power source with our power link tether as well. So what this is going to allow you to do is that power link tether, as you can see on our string trimmer, is going to connect to our handheld tools. Like a battery. And then, yep. Yep. And then you're going to carry two batteries on your back. So you can double the run time on any of our tools. And then as well, that also takes a lot of the weight and fatigue off of the operator. Okay. So two batteries fit in there. Up to what size battery can you put in there? You can put any battery that we have in here. You can do two 2 amp hours, two 10 amp hours. You can do a 10 and a two. It doesn't matter. The big thing here for Toro is that 60 volts is going to be 60 volts. All of the flex force power power system batteries power the Revolution handheld as well as the residential side as well. So Matt, if we max out your biggest battery, two big batteries in here, and again, we're feathering, we're not really burying the trigger. We're using it in work applications, working conditions. Yep. What kind of runtime would you expect on this? Yeah, so with our two 10 amp hour batteries on the backpack blower here, max runtime, we're going to be looking at about 300 minutes. That's going to be real light applications wow. on and off the trigger that's, about 300 uh, Grass clippings, stuff yep, like grass that. grass clippings. If we're exactly. pushing leaves, now we're burying it, it's probably going to drop to 20 minutes or something. Or? Yep, if you're running turbo with two 10s in there, you're probably looking, I think we're just around like the 30 minute mark. Really? That's actually pretty good. I mean, I know some of the competitors are around the 20 minute mark, 25 yeah. maybe. Um, I know I, I only know how to use turbo. Yeah. Just go, Wham! It's mostly sawdust for me because I'm a carpenter. Uh, this is super interesting. And, and price and availability on these things, are they, are they out now? Are they coming out? Yep. Yeah, so everything here is going to be uh, available, uh, all the tools here. Um, the, I believe all three tools, they are starting at $399 for our nice. promo. And then our, rev, our power link tether here is going to be $199. So that's a promo you're running right now? Yep. And then what about this bad boy here? Uh, so the backpack blower as well, that's going to be $399. No way. Yep. Wow, that's really priced. Yep. That's very competitively priced. Yes. Um, and then and all the tools too, they all come uh, bare tool without the batteries. That allows the contractor to kind of pick your power, if you will. Uh, if you've got a larger crew and you want to maximize the amount of runtime they can do, we recommend you know, stocking up on a couple backpacks with those bigger backs. If you've got you know, more concern about operator fatigue, maybe have some of those smaller batteries, you're going to have to swap out more, but it's going to be a lot lighter for the operator. So Matt, that really brings up a good question. So we've talked about these pro tools, the tether, and how pros use these tools. The problem is you got to keep the tools running. And when you don't have electricity in the field, you got to either charge on the go or you got to bring batteries with you. Yep. And you kind of have a solution set up for this, right? Yes. Yep. Well, let's go take a look at that. Yeah, sure thing.